Hi and welcome to Makeup Mug Bump. My name is Leanne. Thank you so much for joining me. I've got a haul today of stuff that's come in in the last week, week and a half, and I want to just share with you what's come in. Some of these things are um, very specific things I wanted and some things just happened. You know, I was like, hey, hey, we're loosey-goosey over here. Uh, I will tell you that these hauls are going to slow down because Mama is trying a no-buy where a weekend and we don't like it but I am super excited to be able to focus on the makeup I currently have and enjoy it and have a great time so um it is absolutely uh needed around here but also um I'm it's not it's not a punishment. I'll be okay. Uh, and I will, I'll continue to make videos on my existing stuff. We'll do all kinds of looks together and try out products. There's products that I've purchased that I haven't been able to use yet, which is why the no buy is needed. But before that, we've got a couple things that are coming in. There's some things that are still that I ordered last month from indie brands and such that haven't come in yet. So there will be probably at least one more haul after this, but let's, let's take a look at what I got recently. So, um, uh, Beekman 1802 had a uh, like a 75% off like a warehouse kind of sale and I have used a couple of their products. I was turned on to them by a subscriber and friend who sent me their makeup wipes like their goat milk makeup wipes. I love them so much. They are so amazing and so from then on I started looking into the brand I have their like their primer serum that has SPF in it it's amazing but the thing I didn't know that they had was fragrance and so in this sale uh, I just clicked on it had an Instagram post I looked and then from there I went I went down the rabbit hole but I got some fragrances from them so Beekman 1802 they have goats like that's their shtick goats and then they put out clean makeup beauty products. No, not really makeup, more beauty. Beauty products that, uh, and skincare and things like that. So uh, I have three fragrances from them. This is the lavender. And I didn't think I liked lavender until, like I would have told you, I, I don't like the scent of lavender. But when I used Ghoul Friend, the Halloween scent from Bath and Body Works, I had like a hand soap maybe three years ago and I used it and I was like wow I really like this what what's in this and on the hand soaps they sometimes they put the like the notes in it and sometimes they don't so I actually went online and looked up the notes in Ghoul Friend and lavender is in it and I was like is it though I actually like lavender I like it I like this it's it's, it's just that it literally is Lavender. That's the scent. It, that's it. It's not anything else. It's just straightforward. So I am super excited. This is uh, 100 mils. Um, it's a beautiful bottle and I am super stoked to have it. I love fragrance. I love using it to lift my mood, my scent, smell, scent um, is extremely strong. And so scents can make me feel things and remember things and I love it so buying new fragrances is something that I have really done in the last two to three years and I'm I love it it's great it makes no matter what's going on uh if I smell good or if I smell things that are good I'm happy okay this is the next one it's called heirloom apple this one is I mean it's apple but there's a there's a little bit woody right? Like, so there's a little bit of woody and I don't mind that at all. It's a very fall scent. This is a very fall scent. And so I will happily use it then. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I like that. And then this one is a beautiful bottle. It's their vanilla absolute. The, the back of the bottle has like, uh, it's, 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 I mean, it's just, it's beautiful. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I've used this a few times since I got I can't stop it. I 
I love uh, vanilla scent. I love uh, sweet scent. Something is there. Oh, I got it. It is a beautiful. It's absolutely gorgeous scent, and I like it very much. These were the three scents that I was the most interested in. Um, and then I picked up another a skincare product. It was on sale at the time, and I always use these, so I'm super excited. This is the, the Buttermilk Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm. I do two, um, a two-step cleanse, when, especially when I wear makeup, and it comes in this beautiful little bag, like good golly. Oh, it's got paperwork. <laughs> Did we even? So it's made of goat milk um, and plant-based butters. How cool. Lovely. Okay, so here's, oh, it's got the little spatulator, but it's got a holder on top. Leanne loves this. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I have, I, I kind of toggle between, uh, I switch off between a cleansing oil and a, like a cleansing balm, just depending on what I've got open at the time. I just finished up a K-Beauty cleansing oil that I had. It was like an almond scent, and it wasn't bad, um, but I, I just finished up that one. So I might actually pop this into the bathroom immediately to start using. I... I cleanse with a balm or an oil, and then I go over with usually some sort of, you know, foaming cleanser, whatever, uh, that I've got going. I've used up several um, this year already. I've got to do my empties for y'all so you can see what those were, um, and I'll talk a little bit about each one. But I, I have, I think, a Clinique one. Uh, it's a foaming cleanser from Clinique that uh, I have like a, like a deluxe sample size that I'm almost used up, uh, but it's it's really good. But this, I'm excited to to use and to try. I love a, uh, a brand that uses, of course, clean products of clean ingredients, but um, that it's cruelty-free and all that jazz. So super excited to use that. All right, next up, let's look at, oh, glory. I have an Ulta order. Let me grab that first. I actually have two Ulta orders, but... This one, they did one of the bubble mailer things, which, you know, whatever. Didn't Ulta used to, like, give samples? Didn't they used to do that? They don't do that anymore, do they? Okay, so this was a specific order. Oh, I remember why. Uh, two things. One, this MAC lipstick was, I don't know, some kind of crazy 50 or 40% off. And I've wanted this color for a while. I haven't bought a MAC, stip, la, MAC lipstick in years. And then um, I got a, I guess I qualified for diamond again, whatever. And so I got a free thing that I had to choose. So I went ahead and cho chose that. Okay, so here's, first let's start with the MAC lipstick. Um, this is a very popular lipstick. It is a luster glass, which I believe, so they, they, I almost said termed. They discontinued the luster lipstick formula. That was my favorite. Um, and I had huge, I mean, huge favorites in the luster lipsticks. And so I think they've replaced it with the luster glass. This is the one that's very popular called Thanks It's Mac. And it is just the most perfect nude. It's just beautiful. Um, let me show you. It's this. So it's a luster glass. Super excited to try it. Um, it looks like it's going to be an everyday nude for me. And I will probably use it slam up. The, another product that came out that I got a sample of. But it was in the bronzy color. And I was like, ooh, that's not really for me. The bronzy color. But they came out with it and it's uh, in a pink pearl. This is from Fenty Beauty. It's their easy or ease drop lit. It's an all over glow enhancer. I think it was like $22. Thought it would be bigger than this. Wasn't. Um, so <laughs> wasn't sure of the size, but this is in the shade pink pearl. Um, and I think that this will be a wonderful primer. Of course, you could add it into your, um, foundations or whatever to make them glowy, but, uh, I use highlighter as primer and 
that's right up my street. Right up my street. I had gotten it in uh, as a, like a, I think a, like a gift with purchase kind of thing. And I got it in um, bronze jasper. And I was like, ooh, that's too dark. Let me show it to you. Um, I actually think it might not be too dark if you use it in your like foundation as to, to deepen it up a little bit, but also maybe just around the perimeter of your face. So super glowy, right? Like absolutely glowy, beautiful. It is, it is dark. It's not, it's not pink pearl. Uh, but I had used, uh, I, I had swatched this, knew that I really liked the formula. It feels like nothing. It's, it's like water. It doesn't feel like anything on your skin. You can't feel the particles or anything. Um, and I knew that I would like it in a lighter shade. So I went ahead and got Pink Pearl again. It's about $22, I think, on Ulta. Um, not bad. Not bad at all. So you can see my skin through it. And it. I, I will use both of them, but the Bronze Jasper probably as a mixer. Um, just not going to probably use that all over my face under foundation. It's just not practical in that shade. I throw that. Okay. The diamond gift that I picked up was the Clinique Redness Solutions Makeup. So I really love Clinique. And I know I'm like a 1990s girl. I got it in the shade 03. No. Apparently before it was the shade 03 Calming Ivory. Now it's the shade CN28 Calming Ivory. I have so many Clinique foundations. I think I have them all now, but this one I didn't have. So let's look at it. Redness Solutions. It has um so it does have SPF 15, which is not enough by any means. Love that bottle. Okay. All right, let's look at you, Calm and Ivory. Oh, she yellow. She peachy yellow. Oh, glory. We would need some blue in that bad boy. We got the wrong shade. <laughs> we'll need some blue. What I would use is probably the LA Girl uh, Foundation Pigment Mixer. But also, I have placed an order with Shop Miss A because they have now like blue pigment drops and white pigment drops and other colors as well. I would probably use that uh, to... Tone that more neutral. That is too warm for her. Um, but, you know, we'll, we'll try it out. Uh, especially if it does, you know, cover redness really well and uh, help. So there's that. Sorry about getting the wrong shade. Meh. Here we go. All right, let's go to an Amazon order that I placed. I placed an order for a product that I already had, and I, I got another one. And this is a silly reason, but I don't care. One, this is great. This is the Leak Beauty, Active Beauty Hydrating BB Cream. I love it. I've used it on my channel once. It's amazing, it's fast, it's whatever. I bought a second one to keep downstairs at my computer because some days I wake up not in enough time to come in here and sit down and like do my whole face. And so I, I keep a bag, like a small, it's my Merit Cosmetics bag. Um, I keep that downstairs with a full face of makeup in it. That's quick and easy to put on. It's the same shades every day. Like I don't change it out. And this would be great in it. Currently in there is a it's an Ulta stick foundation. And I love that, don't get me wrong, but I think I would like this more. So I got the second one to go downstairs so that I would have it downstairs as well. And then I went ahead and got in that second order of leak product. I got two other leak products that, again, this is on Amazon. I've never heard anybody talk about it, but I was absolutely intrigued once I got that BB cream on what else they had. This is their lip and cheek balm in the shade resilient like right let's see what she is that's pretty that is pretty 
Here, let me swatch the BB cream too while I'm here. This one's already been used, but. There's the BB cream. And then there's that Lip and Cheek Balm and Resilient. Golly, I'm happy about that. So we'll try her out on the old face at some point. And I like, I mean, I just, I like how it's, it's inexpensive. I think this was $5. I mean, it was not much at all. And I think this is 5 or $6. You cannot tell me that that's not good. Look at that. So anyway, super excited. And then they had a lip product. Uh, and I, won't, I just bought one of each because I was like, well, I'm not going to look. This is their cream lipstick. I got it in the shade Enchanted. I just don't know. I, I don't, I've never heard of it, but that doesn't mean that it necessarily is great or anything. So this is, it's just, ooh. oh, neat. What an interesting shade. That is right up my alley. Look at that. It's a little bit mauvey, mauvey. Oh my goodness, that's pretty. I like this. It was also like five bucks. Yep, gonna have a great time. That is fabulous. And then one more thing from Amazon. And this was this was the fault of uh, Floating in Dreams of Micah. She lives in the Netherlands. She uh, has, she, she does amazing video, videos. I love her so much. She is uh, very cool to neutral undertone, very fair, and she does, a lot of reviews that are really geared towards fair skin and cool to neutral undertones, which is also what I have. So I I rely a lot on her her opinions on things. This she's done a lot of K Beauty in the last couple of months, which I love K Beauty. Um, and this was one of her uh, BB creams that she was reviewing. So this is the the. Snail Repair Intensive BB Cream by Mizan. It's SPF 50. I got it in the shade 21, which is typically the shade that I wear in Korean BB Creams. Let me get a little bit, ooh, okay, it's ready to come out. Get a little bit there, let me smoosh it around for a second. Oh, okay. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. I love, 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 love K-Beauty um, for their ingredients but also the finishes it's just absolutely beautiful so i will happily use that bb cream i have several more um foundation products that i need to try um i got i've, I've gotten several that, that ulta beauty like 10 point 10 times the points foundation got a good hold on me so i have many foundation products left to try but this is one that i'm gonna put in that list and we'll try it together that way we can see I also want to try these together so we'll we'll give those a, a good whirl so stay tuned for those okay um next is a crazy Ulta order so prepare yourself it is a lot so hang on it's a lot it's a lot okay um okay Okay. This is going to be insane, and I'm kind of not sorry about it, because I did an amazing job with, sorry, I've got to get a place for this stuff to go. I did an amazing job with waiting for the, the right time to order for all of the perks that you could get. So I do this thing that I have a lot of things in my like waiting for later kind of part of my cart. And many of these things I had stored away and then there were these deals. So one thing that I got is the full size of the Giorgio Armani My Way perfume. I have loved this perfume since I had a sample of it. It is a floral perfume and I don't typically like florals. So if you don't like florals necessarily, 
but it's a, it's a sweet floral. I'm wearing it today. It is amazing. And this size, which is the whatever size it is, the 90 mil was 40% off. And then I got five times the points. And then I also got some, um, gifts with purchase. So I had been wait. I love this for a long time and I had been waiting to purchase it when it would get me the most. And so I did, and I could not be happier. This is absolutely stunningly beautiful and I love it. Um, again, Georgia Armani my way and it is everything. The gift with purchase that I got with this one, I yeah, I got two actually. So one of them was a, a fragrance gift with purchase. And then one of them was a hair gift with purchase. And I think I'm gonna do all the gifts with purchase at the end in case you don't care to see those. So give me two seconds because there's a lot. So I placed that order on its own and got all the gifts with purchase with that one. And then I placed another order that was specific for the 10 times 10 times the foundation points again and oh no I got two gifts of purchase with them in my way I forgot okay just kidding um so I got <laughs> when I tell you the amount of stuff I have in front of me it's unbelievable so the 10 times the foundation points, I went ahead and placed an, another order for that um, and picked up a few more things. One thing had just released, but one of the odd things that was included in that was a CoverGirl weightless water cream. Uh, I'd actually heard of this, that this was a, a really good hydrator. It's a 72 hour hydration cream and I love a, a good skincare. So, oh, it's, oh, it's sealed. I don't want I'm not ready to open it yet. So we'll do that. At some point, I'll show you what it looks like because uh, I currently have a holofrog one of them. But this has got hyaluronic acid and all that stuff, cactus water in it and all that jazz. But it was 10 times the points, and I was like, might as well. Like, this is when you get, you bank up those points, and then I've got almost, I think, $400 of points sitting there, um, as you do. So, also, I went ahead and picked up a backup of a powder that I really like. It's very inexpensive, but it was, again, you got 10 times the point, so I went ahead and did it. It's that Essence 16 hour and last. Like, it's great. I get it in the shade Porcelain. Um, I've used this for a while, and it's really, really good. Um, it's comparable to that Maybelline Superstay powder that's really good. Um, it's great. So I went ahead and purchased a backup of that, and then I bought a product that is a foundation product, but uh, I want to use it as a, um, a bronzer. This is from the shit from the brand, excuse me, Black Opal. This is their Mineral Matte Cream Powder Foundation, and I was like, okay, what's that mean? I'm having trouble with the sticker, but it's going to be fine. So it does have some SPF. It's SPF 15, um, and it is. This is in the shade truly topaz. It looks a little bit more green mustardy. It's not, it's a little less than that. Okay, so it is a cream. Ooh, it is and it is a yellowy shade. What an interesting shade. Let me buff it out and let's see what that would look like. Maybe as a bronzer. Okay. Okay. We'll try it. We'll try it. That's all we can do. All we can do is try it. It was inexpensive as well, but it was 10 times the point. So, okay, let's go. Interesting. We'll try it out. We'll see what we think. We will see what we think. Okay. Then this is the new product that came out. And of course I wanted to try it. This is the Bare Minerals Original Pure Serum Radiant Natural Liquid Foundation. This is new. And I got the shade Fair Cool 1.5. Y'all, Bare Minerals can almost do no wrong, in my opinion. And I can't tell you how excited I am to try this. SPF 20 pump. I love their Bear Pro. Oh my goodness, I love their Bear Pro. Do I need to turn you or something to let you get going? Hello? Oh, I guess I do. Okay. 
runny. But not the runniest. Radiant Natural Liquid Foundation. Feather Light Natural Radiant Finish helps to improve skin's tone and smooth skin texture over time. Okay, let's rub it out. Oh my gosh, it is so thin. It is so thin. Yes, queen, yes. Oh my goodness, this is going to be good. Oh, this is going to be good, y'all. I can already tell. I'm going to love it. Cannot wait to try that. Okay, I tell you, I've got so many foundation products because of that Ulta sale. But this was brand new, and I was super stoked to get that. Okay, let's find a place for you, friend. All right, that is, that's it for what I purchased. And if you want to see the world's largest haul of gift with purchases, keep on watching because I got an obscene amount of gifts with purchase, like obscene. So with both the My Way Giorgio Armani order and the this last Bare Mineral Serum order, I got three, yeah, three different Gifts with purchase, and actually with the fragrance when I got another one. Jesus, take the wheel. Okay, so we got a primer. Gift with purchase. And I got, so I have two of them, right? Like I have one that came with one and one that came with the other. All right, here we go. Here's the primers that I got. Bare Minerals Prime Time. Jane Iredale Primed for More Illuminating Glow Primer. Yes. Oh, Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. Oh, it's a little baby. Look. But it's a good size. A foil of the Estee Lauder Futurist Aging. No, Aqua Brilliance. The Professional this one. I haven't tried this one yet. Light primer. Look at this. The e.l.f. little power grip. The Coats Face Prime and Protect. It's a tinted mineral sunscreen, SPF 40. And then Indie Lee Brightening Cream Strawberry Leaf and Squalane. So I have two. Oh wait, that's the order that I got. The Bronze Jasper Fenty in. Hang on, where'd I put that? There it is. I also got this. It's full size. I know it doesn't seem like it, but it is. This is the light. Hold on. It is the Ease Drop Lit All Over Glow Enhancer. It came in bronze jasper, which is too dark for me. Like it's a bronze color, but you could use it on the perimeter face or as a foundation mixer, which is probably how I'm going to use it. So that was the primer gift with purchase. Let's do the the fragrance gift with purchase because it was unbelievable. Again, I got that by way for like 40% off plus five times the points plus the primer. I'll show you the hair one and this fragrance gift with purchase all in one order. Okay, I've got the Lake and Sky Santal Gray. It is um, really not, this is a really, really nice fragrance. Um, it is a, like a spray, like a travel spray, but it's the whole thing. Then I got baby perfumes, and y'all, I can't with baby perfumes. I love them so much. I got the Ralph Lauren Romance. Stop. Look at that. I got the Dolce & Gabbana. Is it called Queen? Look at the little lid. Stop. Estee Lauder Beautiful Magnolia. Look, that's a spray. And then this one I was super stoked about. It's the Eilish number two. It's Billie Eilish's number two. Look at that. I love it 
so much. Those are amazing. For free, y'all. For free. With my purchase. Alright, let me show you the hair. That's the last one. This one I have again two of. Here we here we go. I lied. There's I have another foundation one. Jesus, take the wheel. Uh, Bondi Boost Heat Protectant Spray. Living Proof Smooth Styling Spray. Kristen S. Air Dry Cream. Viviscal Thickening Shampoo and Strengthening Conditioner. IGK Body Language Rice Water Plumping and Thickening Mist. Purology Color Fanatic Multitasking Leave-In Spray. Olaplex Bonding Oil. Virtue Restorative Treatment Mask. Bio Silk Silk Therapy with Natural Coconut Oil and Bumble and Bumble Hairdressers Invisible Oil. I got two of those. And then I got the foundation one. Hold on. Okay, I lied. That Bronze Jasper Fenty Beauty wasn't in the primer. It was in the foundation one. So just FYI. So I have two of those. Got a Bare Minerals Collection Complexion Rescue Winky Luxe Peeper Perfect Under Eye Concealer. Tarte Maracuja Juicy Glow. And then a bunch of these. So It Cosmetics CC Plus. Your skin, but better. Sorry. Uh, Too Faced Born This Way Ethereal Light uh, Concealer, which I'm actually interested to try. Clinique Even Better Little Foil Anastasia Luminous foundation foil, Laura Mercier, um, flawless, weightless, whatever it's called, Clinique Even Better, Revlon Illuminance, and L'Oreal True Match. All the gifts with purchase. All of them. Um, and that's how, that's how you do it, kids. <laughs> that's how you try a lot of products and you have a great time with makeup and yeah, you strategically hold your stuff until you can make it worth your while. I appreciate y'all watching. Thank you so much for watching this haul. Again, there'll probably be one more, um, after this of a, like a generic haul and then we'll be done for a little while because mama's got to use all these products and try them out. Uh, also my Sydney Grace Christmas in July, including mystery bags haul. I'll be filming that next. So it's coming up. Hit subscribe if you haven't already hit like, if you liked this, uh, video, I appreciate all of your support. Thank you so much. I'll see y'all soon.